Elspeth Healy. I'm a Special Collections Librarian at the Kenneth Spencer Research Library on KU's campus. The Digital Humanities Seminar seeks to be a forum on campus for conversations about um, digital humanities research uh, and projects. And we sort of broadly conceive of that. So it's a really inclusive group. So the thing that I would encourage um, both uh, graduate students, um, faculty members on campus, uh, and others to come attend the meetings um, and sort of see. It's a good place for people who are curious about the digital humanities but maybe haven't yet taken a step um, to become involved in it to come and get a sense of what's going on because there's a sort of wide showcase of different types of research that are, ha that are involving um, digital methodologies. So the seminar traditionally has had both speakers on campus and then external speakers that we bring from outside. And it's really wonderful to have those external speakers come as well um, because they sort of infuse the DH environment on our campus with work that's happening elsewhere and cutting edge work that's happening elsewhere. Um, so this semester our two external speakers are Kian Pedue of um, Eastern Michigan University uh, and uh, Paloma Vargas of the Technologic <laughs> Technologico de Monterey. Paloma Vargas will be uh, talking about um, building a DH center um, in Mexico uh, and the differences with DH centers here in the United States. Um, and Keon Pettyway will be talking about uh, um, social justice and the digital humanities. Um, and he has been a part of projects, uh, digital projects involving the legacy of Martin Luther King Jr. Um, and so he's sort of interested in the intersection of race, design, and digital humanities. Um, and so we'll be talking about that. And he's in the communications uh, department at Eastern Michigan University. One of the favorite things I have is just the support of the uh, faculty members involved. Um, it's a really welcoming and warm community, um, supportive. Uh, they will <laughs> come out to events, they will help you with your research, they will help push your project forward, they will challenge you with interesting new ideas, they will expose you to cutting edge research that's happening in the field in an area that you might not have ever thought of delving into. Um, and so it's a really important and exciting intellectual community on campus.